Hello folks, this is our first set of questions. It is uh, 2019 May June paper 13. This uh, question is concerned with uh, the chapter of uh, current electricity. It says that a student has a set of identical cells, so that means all the cells have the uh, same EMF uh, and identical lamps, so that means uh, their power reading is same, which means that uh, their uh, resistance is same. The cells have negligible internal resistance, so we don't have to take care of the uh, internal resistance. A lamp connected to cell lights with normal brightness. So we have a lamp connected to a cell and it has got normal brightness. So that means that if I have this, uh, uh, this is the EMF, this is the EMF, this is the resistance and if I say this is the current, the value of I will be equal to simply E divided this R. So it lights with normal brightness means it has got a certain power rating, power rating, uh, which means uh, we have uh, this uh, power will be equal to simply I square R, uh, I square R, and that's equal to I square will be equal to uh, E square uh, by, uh, let us say it is E by R whole square into R, it's equal to E square by R. So it uh, will uh, consume a power equivalent to E square by R. Now what happens when the student connects the lamps and the cells as shown? So if uh, this arrangement is changed to this, uh, so we have to uh, find what happens. What happens means whether the bulbs will uh, glow with uh, less brightness or higher brightness or normal brightness, we have to identify. So this requires that, uh, this requires that whether the current through each of these things is same or not. The resistance is same, R is same for all of them. We just have to find if the current is same. If the current is same, they will have normal brightness. If the current is high, they will have a higher brightness. And if the current is less, they will have less brightness. So this is E, uh, this is E, and this is also E, also E. So now we have to find uh, the currents through each of these things. Current through this, through this, and through this. In terms of, let us say, uh, E and R. For that purpose, so let me say this is a uh, this current is I1, this current is I1, and let me say this current is uh, I2, let us say, let us say, and if so, uh, this current should divide to this and this, so this current should be I2 minus I1, so this should be I1, so I1 here, I1 here, and uh, this should be, so since it has to be I2, this thing has to be I2. So let me I Kursov's laws in these loops. So if I consider this loop, if I consider this loop only, what I have is the source of EMF is E, uh, sum of EMF is equal to sum of the potential differences. So the source of EMF is E here. So E is equal to, if I come here, it's equal to I1 into R. And so if I come like this, come like this, say it is negative of the direction of current. So it should be minus, minus I2, minus I1, I1, then it is R. So E is equal to I1 R, I1 R minus I2 minus I1 R. It is for this loop. So if I consider the another loop here, this loop here, it will be E is equal to, E is equal to, uh, so from here I have to have I2 minus I1 R, I2 minus I1 R, R, uh, plus plus I2 into R I2 into R so since uh, both the E's are equal let me equate these things so if I equate them I will have I1 R minus I2 minus I1 R is equal to I2 minus I1 R plus I2 R plus I2 R so I have to uh, I have now do all the multiplications here so um, if I do like this, so yeah, so this uh, uh, this thing when it goes here, it will be it will be so I one R is equal to when it goes here, it will be two I two minus I one R plus I two R. So it will be equal to two I two R minus two I one R plus I two R. So this means it comes here, these two add. So when it comes, it will be equal to I1 R plus 2 I1 R is equal to 2 I2 R plus I2 R, which gives us, or 
3 i1 r equal to 3 i2 r so r r cancel 3 3 cancel which means that i1 is equal to i2 so this uh, treatment gives that this i1 and i2 are equal so if they are equal this thing is equal to 0 this thing is equal to 0 so that means this uh, branch is useless that means there is no current over this branch so the circuit will now be equal to somewhat like this simply this bulb here and this lamp here and like this so it is e it is e it is r and it is r so we have i1 is equal to i2 so the current here is is same here so this current is same here so this value should be equal to so this whole thing is equal to so i nu let us say should be equal to for this circuit we have got a 2e here and we have got the series resistance here which is equal to 2r so that's equal to e by r so that means the current through these things will be same which is equal to i equal to e by r so this e by r is equal to e by r is equal to the previous i so the current through this thing and this thing is same as the current through this so that means the power rating should also be equal to is the same thing here so power rating through this and this should be same that means uh, the brightness of this and this are same same as this same as this so if it is normal it's also normal and whether uh, for two it will be current zero so it, it will not glow so it will have less brightness so we have one and three same brightness same uh, brightness same means uh, uh, same means uh, normal brightness here normal brightness but two we have got no brightness two does not glow at all so that means see if i go through the choices here choice number a says all three lamps lights normal brightness is not true choice number b say, b says only lamp two lights with normal brightness lamp two does not glow on true choice number c says only lamps one and three light with normal brightness so this is true true and d is untrue so the choice number should be choice number c